The boys were awestruck at the sight. Mouths agape and eyes solidly locked on the spectacle. Finally, Joe yelped, What is that? James, the omnipresent protector of Joe, offered an answer. It's a drone. These drones are used for animal control, especially for predators in enclosed wildlife parks. I don't think there's any here. Looks like a mystery to me, Joe quipped. The other members of his gang were too awestruck to respond. Within minutes, the silent drone hums to life and begins its methodical swoop around the swamp. And as quickly as it appeared, it vanishes into the horizon. The swamp that was circling the drone eventually broke their formation and went about their ways. The skies above Philip's family farm was calm and clear again. Everybody that saw the display of the drone and its ability to control the swamp caught everyone by surprise. Guys, we have a mystery on our hands. Philip rolls his eyes after hearing this from the unelected head of the gang of four. What mystery? It's probably just a normal service drone from one of the UNE facilities around here and probably found out what was happening and decided to help. Now, it was Joe's turn to roll his eyes. But before he could do that, Mr. Quick Malik rushes in and announces that he has an idea. Azrin, the quietest of the group, smirks. He was always the deep thinker in the group. Every action was measured. Every decision involved deep analysis of the issue. Malik, however, was an anomaly. He was the one that provided the laughs, the break from stressful situations. I think James can help us. I think he knows. I'm sure he knows where the drone was from. He can help us, Joe. Joe thinks for a minute, then grudgingly nods his head in agreement. Philip, however, was adamant that this was something routine. Nothing to waste the gang's time on, especially when there are more worthwhile pursuits they can do. Joe, ever the adventurer, is taking his normal line in that everything is a mystery and that there are forces beyond their understanding that needs to be unlocked. It's settled then. We investigate. Unilateral decision-making was always Joe's strength, except when it comes to his family, which, incidentally, would have observed all this through James. I need some alone time with James tonight. James. We are friends, correct? But Mark needs to be updated. The stream I sent is still unopened. I shall have to update her. Those are details she doesn't need to know, James. I think the fact that I'm home with you, with a full belly, getting ready for bed, is enough for her to know. Don't you think so? The negotiations continue late into the night, with neither giving in to their point of view. What was that black drone, James? It came from nowhere. You had to spoil it by showing up. I had everything under control. I was showing that drone you shouldn't mess around with Joe from Rambau. In his excitement of recounting his experience earlier, the young adult, which he calls himself to his parents, was jumping around showing James his skill with a make-believe broom which Philip had given to the gang. Swoosh! Are you afraid, drone? Ha <laughs> ha! Joe, I think that's enough for now. You are getting excited and your adrenaline is up, which is not good if you're about to go to bed. Joe, I think a warm cup of tea would calm you down. The ever-efficient James disappears for a few seconds and reappears with a warm mug of soothing tea, devoid of sugar, of course. Here, Joe, drink this. Slowly but surely, Joe begins to calm down. Thanks, James. So, where were we? Drones and AI do not sigh, but there have been reports of fleeting glimpses of self-aware drones eliciting human traits. If there were the equivalent of an AI sigh from a drone, it would be now. There is no where were we discussion, Joe. You are about to go to bed, and that is exactly what you'll be doing. I need to do my report to Mark. All right, James, you can report. But before you do, I need a favor. I saw you handle that drone like you've seen it before. Can you explain that? I need to know that because I'm afraid for Philip and his family. It might come back and cause problems for them. 
Job blurted what he needed to say to James with the hope that his decision algorithm might sway him to provide the information the gang needs. I will need a bit of time to process this request, Joe. In the meantime, I suggest you prepare yourself a bit whilst I proceed with my updates to Mark. Joe shrugs his shoulders and walks slowly to his bed in a resigned fashion just to reinforce his feeling of defeat to James. But the smirk is allowed, albeit disguised.